Chinese tennis star Peng Shui had a video call on Sunday with the president of the International Olympic Committee and told him she was safe and well, the IOC said, after Western governments expressed mounting concern for her well-being. Images of Peng at a children's tournament in Beijing published earlier in the day had done little to quell unease following a nearly three-week public absence after she alleged that a former senior Chinese official had sexually assaulted her. In a statement, the IOC said Peng began the 30-minute call with its president, Thomas Bach, by thanking the Olympic organization for its concern. It added that Peng, quote, explained that she is safe and well, living at her home in Beijing, but would like to have her privacy respected at this time. Current and former tennis players, from Naomi Osaka to Billie Jean King, had joined the call seeking to confirm she was safe using the social media hashtag, where is Peng Shui? The whole community, tennis community, needs to uh, back her up and, and her family and, and uh, make sure that, uh, that she's safe and sound. World number one Novak Djokovic said it would be strange to hold tournaments in China unless the, quote, horrific situation was resolved. On November 2nd, Peng posted on Chinese social media that former Vice Premier Sheng Gao Li had sexually assaulted her several years ago. Neither Sheng nor the Chinese government have commented on her allegation. Peng's social media post was quickly deleted, and the topic has been blocked from discussion on China's heavily censored Internet. The concern over Peng came as global rights groups and others have called for a boycott of the Winter Olympics in Beijing in February over China's human rights record.